People, what's going on? It's, <laughs> it's Friday night, late session today. We're at Foundry Gym, Warsaw. It's about half eight. We're gonna get our second to last session in from the week. It's pool day. Obviously, Troy, two weeks out this weekend. He can't really function so much today, so you're probably not gonna hear much from him, but he is here with us in spirit. <laughs> he's brain dead, but it don't matter. As long as he's here, we're gonna push him through the workout. But yeah, we're gonna um, train pool. Obviously, same setup as always. We've got Dan on the camera. We've got some new little uh, bits of equipment, so hopefully we're gonna make a movie with it as well. Different location for the video today. And yeah, man, I'm just gonna have a laugh, get a good session in. Um, we got legs tomorrow, and then we're wrapping it up for the weekend, so no fucking around. Big pool session, let's go get it. I, I don't play, I'll give her the wooden In the pot like I'm making a pudding He's just pissed cause his girl took chucking Right starting up, I don't care how he's looking S15 from the deep end Man let it sing, sing, sing like the weekend Bally on my face to deceive them Feds on my block trying to find out who's squeezing Run man down on recording Ching my man put sword in See this friend, friend thing is appalling Never came back when his bread and called him Tool so shot might sort him Thought it was blanks to one of them caught him Somebody's life is gonna get shortened They know when I speak, it's always important Ride with the watch and call it Talk about sticks and you couldn't afford it Remember them days I couldn't afford them I was in old trying to change my Jordans Jump out, rise, no warning Looking for bodies to throw some corn in Told man it ain't me, you're falling Spin my block, gonna leave it crawling Alright, so, all day Obviously, bear with me, the music's loud in here So, um, obviously we're trying to keep the intensity as high as possible Troy, like I said, Troy is mad depleted at the moment Like he's obviously three weeks from the last show Two weeks to the next show And he's been in his depleted state since, I don't know, for the last eight weeks So, the key to getting the most out of session is Get in, get out, we do two work sets on everything And just keep it as intense as possible So we've really done within like 40, 50 minutes max Because anything longer than that is going to flake out And it's going to become like counterproductive so, starting with some heavy cable, um, cable rows, super safe some straight on pull downs, um, and then we're just moving on to some pull downs now. Same again, couple warm up sets, and then your two work sets. So, like I said before, when the, the way that we train, we, we, we only do two work sets, sometimes even one work set. But because we're all used to training with each other and we know each other's ability and our strengths and whatnot, it's very easy for us to just keep it moving because we know where each other's at. So, if you're trying to implement the way we train into your workouts, it may take a little bit longer to start with. Because obviously you've got to figure out what your working weight is, figure out when you can push that a little bit harder, and when you've got to, you know, pull it back a little bit. But once you do, they become like really effective. So even though there's four of us, like I said, we can get in and out within 45 minutes to an hour, get a really good workout in. So second exercise, normal um, straight bar pull downs, two work sets. So that's like when it comes to these kind of sets, especially when you're prepping, you feel like you got 12 in you, but like you probably get to about two or three and you completely go. So this is where you need someone kind of with you just to push you through them reps, just to like, you know, even if they're spotting you, you know. At least 50% of the rep is still giving 100% during those sets. This is where I need everyone there kind of thing, because I'm getting those reps out, but I'm not getting the full potential if I was on my own kind of thing. So, just gotta keep pushing. I did it before. Or sure as well fucking seen it If the man them got him before Then got him again as a fucking remix Didn't get the message before We send it again and you receive it Needs get dealt with immediate Slap on attack I ain't gotta repeat it Gang gang and they know this Squeeze out whoever gets closest If they knew what we had in the motors They can't afford not to focus Rock chains not chokers I'm in the tea like a fucking mocha Jump out on a choker Make a meet with this elegant poker Ain't gotta respect it Love your soul for we come and collect it The whole looks small in the entrance But it was way more peak on the exit Hey, so We're gonna go two rows We're gonna use this um, Like chest supported yeah. Chest supported Like a T-bar row But we're gonna go a bit of a wide grip And then there's a low row over there, hammer strength low row. So obviously, as we always say, when we go to different gyms, we've got to make the most of the equipment that we haven't got. So we haven't got this at, at, um, at Aesthetic. And we haven't got a low row anymore either. So definitely going to make the most of these. As always, two working sets. Probably go one warm-up set on each one. And the warm-up sets, they're not actually 
like to warm up, obviously you will warm, do you know what I mean? But warm up in the sense of just the movement. You don't want to switch straight from one movement to another, straight into working weight, even though it's the same muscle group. So it's a different angle, different movement. So we do one or two warm up sets, as long as we need to feel comfortable, and then go straight into working sets. But at this point, literally we do a few reps on each, and then go straight to working. So as you can see from there, like this is where Troy will start to play, but that's where it's our job now to make sure he gets the reps out and just does what he needs to do. So we're not building any muscle at this point. It's just about fully depleting him, trying to bring that condition through. And just keep him as full as possible by training as heavy and as hard as possible. So two working sets again, supersetting these two though, so a little bit more volume. Still put dick in my exes, line phone ring, I ain't sending out texts. They know that the man them reckless, ops get carried out, line on stretchers. Do shit elegant. They don't buy shit, they're celibate. Huh? Born for the mash, got hell of it. Big 4 4 will knock down elephants. Yeah. I ain't down for the combo. Hit my man with a combo. All old shit got oh, trouble. Oh, 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 squeeze, squeeze. Oh, man. Um, it's always good to obviously plan out the sessions. I don't know if anyone who's been following will realize we don't actually have a set training um, routine in terms of selective exercises. It's more about the split that we do. It's more about the intensity. Because we're always training with different, different people, different groups. Um, the main thing we focus on is just literally the intensity and what we're working rather than, you know, specific, specific exercises. Like, for example, bench press. We're not really trying to, we're not trying to really focus on our lifts, are we, all the time. So it's like, we don't really have something to progress on. It's more just about productive training rather than anything else. So, especially when you come to new gyms, we always talk about trying new equipment. Um, just getting in different environments, really, and just trying out new things. Going, come on, get it up. <laughs> Last one. Good. Come back up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One. Uh, one of the best we have to get up. Let's go. Put them up. Squeeze. Squeeze. Up. Squeeze. Yeah. Good. And again. Four of them. Good. And again. Up. Three more. Up. Two more. Two more. Up. Good. Last one. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Oh, fuck. That's the worst thing about doing that whole shit. I just made that up as we went along, but then because I'm last, you have to do it at the end, I have to do it at the end. And I wish I never did. That was horrible. That's good though. Good set, man. A little bit so different, like, like Troy was saying earlier. There's no, because we've been training for so long and we've been training with each other for so long, we don't, like, we've got a structure, but we don't have a plan, so to speak. We literally train by feel, but because we work as a unit, train as a unit, we can, we can do that together. So, we're literally just making it up as we go along. <laughs> now, Jim, I need to start looking at you all day. Yeah. Like he doesn't know what is that going on. You're all right, mate. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we, we've got no plan. He literally has no idea what's going on. <laughs> but that's where we come in. We are bad. Uh, boys, go for back. So, done for back. Move on, get some biceps in. Got it, master. Get some biceps in. Finish up the session. It's good. You know what's going on, but you just can't yeah. register. Anyone that's prepping knows yeah, it's like understanding it. in his head. You he want he's saying stuff. He's involved. <laughs> he's here laughing and joking with us. But physically, it's just not nothing's happening. <laughs> like he's having so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> I promise you, he's yeah, having he's so much fun right now. Himself, <laughs> yeah, well, we know that. That's all that matters. <laughs> right. Biceps. Biceps. <laughs> right, so, moving on to biceps, but... Oh, wait, no, forget that. So, um, obviously, today's, today's a... Curse yourself now. Yeah, ever since uh, <laughs> Dan said how, like, complimented me on how good it was at just going, and ever since he said that, I've been fucking up time and time again. <laughs> Put the pressure on. But yeah, no, we were just talking about the energy of the session tonight, and uh, like, I, I, wait, like I, I've talked, spoke about it on my Instagram and stuff like that all the time, but sometimes you haven't like the motivation and the energy and the enthusiasm isn't always there um, even for us who like this is what we do day in day out um, but obviously today energy is good 
even though Troy is not fully reared for his show, obviously that's why I keep saying it's down to us, we work as a team and it's down to us to make sure, you know, we keep the motivation high, keep the energy high. But, um, and I feel like that's why we, 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 uh, no, we, we're progressing and we're doing well because we, we take the energy of the group and try and put that into training and just make sure it's positive. Like, you know how we go, we have a laugh, we have fun with it, but we're dead serious and we work hard with it at the same time. And I think tonight's session is like, a, it just shows that it's really good energy, and especially for myself as well. Obviously, I, I, I don't have a you know, as I haven't been training for a while and then just started back the last few weeks. Even now I still have an odd session where I struggle, even this week, even like a few days ago, where um, I lack the motivation, I lack the energy to train, but the more I'm around these guys, the more I'm around Troy, seeing like how he's smashing the shows, seeing how Phil smashing his off season, seeing how Tigers come on so far since he started training us, that's what gets me going again, man. So I feel like you need to get a, get a, a good group of training partners, a good group of friends, that are all moving in the right direction and you go a long way. Like I said, if one of us are down, the rest of us pick the rest of them pick us up and vice versa. And that's what's got me back going to be honest. And I, I know Troy's had a hard few days with his prep, but we're not gonna let him drop the bell there and so on and so forth, man. So it's good man. And obviously you guys comment on it, that's what you like as well, because I feel like you can see and feel the energy that we bring. So yeah man, it's a good session, I'm enjoying it, enjoying being back. Let's go get it, biceps. Oh man. Just to up the intensity and get a, get a really horrible set out. So 
four reps, followed by a five second hold six times, and then we actually, we're actually going to be done now. Like, 
bodybuilding is they say it's an individual sport but to us it's not we do this as a team so choice got his cardio to do so we all stay here with him to make sure he does his cardio give him a little bit of support to make things a little bit easier anyone that's prepping or just do cardio in general you know that it's, it's long especially when you're depleted when you're hungry it's nearly 10 o'clock so we're gonna stay here chat shit to him make him get through a little bit easier but um yeah man sick little workout don't normally train this late on a friday but um like we said earlier it's nice to just switch it up a little bit switch the environment off and uh yeah man it's been a good session foundry's always sick good music on it's always open as well it's always busy in here so it's good energy man but we're gonna call it a day there We've got one more session left tomorrow, which we're going to try and film as well. We haven't got Dan with us, so it won't be the quality of this video, but it'll be decent. It'll be to watch until the next one anyway. But as always, appreciate all the support on the videos. Shout out everyone giving us feedback as well on all the last videos. Everyone seems to be enjoying it. The subscribers are going up, the views are going up, so keep supporting the channel. And if you're not subscribed, press subscribe now. Comment below, interact with us, get involved. And we're going to keep the content coming, so everyone have a good weekend or good week whenever you're watching this. We'll catch you in the next video.